I met a nice uh, German uh, gentleman uh, here yesterday while uh, testing the robot and uh, we agreed that we are going to do a delivery. So we are going to deliver some groceries to him. Now our robot is at its uh, starting point of its autonomous driving route. Its cameras are looking around. It generally knows its location at one inch accuracy. So now the robot is driving autonomously. It looks around, it sees where, where the sidewalk is, and it, uh, it adapts its speed based on obstacles. And now it's slowing down because it's approaching a driveway and it's looking around for cars. It doesn't see any cars, so that's, that's why it's continuing right now. So now the robot is slowing down because it's a busy street and it wants to do that to turn properly. The Starship robot is designed uh, to be not 100% autonomous, so at some point it actually needs the help of an operator. In some difficult spots the robot calls uh, out for help. Like for instance here. Here is a driveway and the robot is, is not sure whether there are car, ca cars coming or not. There are cars on, on the left here. So, but right now it's actually a safe situation, so I will tell the robot to continue. Doing all that navigation autonomously right now is not that an operator is helping that. Now another driveway is approaching, the robot is slowing down. But there's no danger, so it's continuing. The robot is programmed to avoid you know, pedestrians and and you know obstacles so it drives past them and uh, that's why it's, it's constantly on the lookout. Hello, this is your robot delivery. Wow. Wow. <laughs> How much do I owe you? You don't owe me anything. Do I get a movie of this too? The drive took uh, about uh, 10 minutes. We achieved about 90% autonomous driving. Right now it was a good run, so it's a good robot.